The less processed it sounds to me, um, so a, a pedal should should uh, enhance the sound of your guitar and your amp. Um, I, when I look for in a pedal, overdrive pedal, is something that enhances and that, that doesn't sound artificial. Okay, Roman. So this is the moment we've been waiting for, the unveiling of the signature Frank Symes distortion pedal. So here we go. The overdrive pedal. Wow, look at that. Wrapped in velvet. So here we go. And we work together to make this happen. And here it is. Wow, look at that. The Frank Symes overdrive. Wow. Amazing. Looks beautiful. And it's number one. Yes, <laughs> yeah, Roman, you uh, texted me when you finally made this number one, and here it is. Yeah. It's got a nice sustain when you need it. Good for blues, good for rock. I had no connections in LA, but I moved to LA when I was 15. Made my way up, slow way up the each rung of the ladder, so to speak, and wound up playing with Martha Davis of the Motels. That led me to playing with Don Henley. I wrote a couple songs with him. Um, I wrote a, one of them was a single, and which helped me buy this house. <laughs> I played with uh, Stevie Nicks, Warren Zevon. I played on Rod Stewart's record. Uh, played with uh, Roger Waters of Pink Floyd. I've uh, uh, played with Roger Daltrey of um, The Who for almost 20 years now. Um, and I played with The Who as their musical director for seven years. This is the number one production model and uh, we're uh, giving it, putting it through the uh, acid test, and um, it is responding to all my dynamic changes of, uh, of my playing. When I'm playing soft, or when I'm playing hard or medium, and all those gradations of dynamics in between, it's responding to all of it. So that's why I like it so much. <laughs> That's why um, I think we work together on this, because I think you had a pretty good idea of my philosophy on guitar tone, and I'm quite discriminating about it, very selective about what I play. I know what sounds good to my ears, so most people tend to agree. <laughs> like my old 62 Strat or my 57 Les Paul Jr. or 56 Tele, um, they have a tone and um, I want the pedal to enhance the tone rather than sort of make it artificial. Definitely what you put in between the amp and the guitar makes a big difference. So if anybody wants to get this pedal, go to snobletone.com and you could buy it directly from the site.